made coffee yet. So we're going to go to Mackay today and we're going to see Cam Court. Here we are. So you look different without the canopy on. <laughs> <laughs> nice fashion. Thanks. So today is a big day. We're going to reap the rewards of the hunter-gatherer lifestyle. I'm Matt and this is Holly. We've been travelling around Australia for the past 12 months in our old Toyotas, going to some of the most incredible locations. Subscribe and join the adventure. Hey everyone and welcome back to another episode. This episode we are heading to Mackay in Queensland to visit our friends who you might remember from our time over in WA. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Just gonna make some scrambled eggs with a little bit of leftover for sure. And then after that, what are we doing? Going to Rockhampton. No, we're not. We're going to Mackay. We've already been to Rock. <laughs> Haven't had coffee yet. So we're going to go to Mackay today. And we're going to see Cam Court from yeah. a fair few episodes ago now. Uh, we caught up with them in. Exmouth or around Western Australia, so Shark Bay, Exmouth, Coral Bay. Um, yeah, and they're awesome, and they've got a really nice 79 series here. So we'll go see them and catch up. Also, if you like what the shirt Matt's Ooh. wearing, you can buy these on our online store. It's drawn by me. Yeah. To you. Hand drawn. Front and back. <laughs> And we should also have some new merch out by now, so check that out as yeah, well. Yeah, check that on out now as well.
pretty crazy. Ooh, we're getting ice cream. <laughs> Thanks a lot. What? How was your ice cream? Ice cream was great. <laughs> Pie was really good also, wasn't it, Holly? It was good. Classic female logic. <laughs> like, I might get a pie. Oh, yeah. No, I don't really want anything. Not I that. didn't say that. And she goes, I'm not that hungry. I said, I'm not that hungry, so do you want to share something? You so, have selective hearing. No, yeah, you did say that. But when you say, oh, okay, like, I'm not that hungry, I'll share something, I thought that meant, mate, like, a bite or two. Get the pie, li Holly literally just cuts it in half immediately, and it's just like, what happened to the not hungry, not even really feeling like anything, and to suddenly just having exactly half when I'm clearly hungry? <sighs> Female logic, eh? Let's go. We were just in Mackay, um, we have pretty much spent the majority of the day here. We went to the library, got some work done while Port and Cam were coming home from work. Just a shout out to Perry. We just saw him in traffic and he sent us a message. Um, and thanks for the offer for staying at your hotel. If we have an edge to take you up on the offer, we definitely will. Yeah, that'd be um, mad, that'd be nice. That'd be mad. Um, yeah, so we're just gonna go see Port and Cam now and spend a couple of days with them. Should be fun. Yeah, it should be a lot of fun. Here we are. So you look different without the canopy on. <laughs> Good morning. Here we are in Mackay and today we're doing something pretty fun. We're actually going to throw some grab pots out, uh, take Tinny out for a little burn um, with Cam. So that'll be fun. Hopefully uh, get some nice big delicious mud crab to eat. Hey you go, mate. All good? All good, man. We're done. I'm good lot of help I am. <laughs> Helping out that trailer. Whew. Matty, get the important stuff done. So today is a big day. We're going to reap the rewards of the hunter-gatherer lifestyle. The pots have been in overnight and I reckon they're just going to be chockers. Absolutely chockers full of crabs. So very pumped, very excited to see what we have. It's going to be, you know, pulling it up and ooh, what do we got? It's going to be interesting. <laughs> so yeah, get ready. We'll probably do a Matt's Camp cooking show. No, we're not camping uh, on different various crab recipes because we're just going to have crab coming out of our ears. <laughs> Woo, exciting. Nice fashion. Thanks. That's the back. <laughs> nice.
hard to lift, I reckon, with all the crabs. I'm thinking about it. Have a look at him, he's too small though. What have we got? No, he's not too big. Absolute nothing. Bloody nothing. Shit, eh? I was whole dragging that in then. <laughs> no good. Hop up. All right. So we had a bloody good day in the water. Um, we ended up getting two crabs of legal size. Um, and we got a couple of others that were the right size, but they were a bit soft, a bit spongy, so they'd obviously just molted recently. Two's still good. We'll get a good little feed out of them and we'll cook them up now and show you the process. How'd you enjoy the water hole? It was good fun. I pulled up what, a few Hole times. was a lucky charm. It was. That never happens. <laughs> How'd the but fishing... Uh, Shirt go. I get them. I understand it. They're still so ugly, but I totally get it. it makes sense. One thing to do after a successful day is hunting, 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 eh? Hunting and gathering. One of many thousands of stubby holders Cam has. Yeah, a little bit of a collection. How much money do you reckon you sunk into your collection, mate? Should I not ask or? Conservatively, I would say three, four hundred. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We've got a bit of water on the on the ball here, bloody hell mate, this is... You've cooked crabs before. A couple. Okay. Got the boil, in they go. The boil, that's just nerves. Delicious. Um. Oh, smell that. So the only game here is to stop them from cooking further. So you jam them into cold water, if you can get it. It's going to be cool, not cold, but good enough. Beautiful. Unreal. Just, um, I've got the ute on a 240 volt charger here, battery charger. Um, it's just a SeaTech 25 amp charger that Cam had. I think it's just, I wanted to point out, this is the first time this year I've put it on 240. So I've, you know, been going around the whole country and doing all that and using the power system the whole time, running fridges and charging our gear and all that. And just recently, the batteries are really starting to be put on the ritz a bit, just not holding charge very long and just the typical kind of stuff when I think one battery sort of cooked itself and then sort of brought the others down with it. But that's all right. It just had to last me the year and it's done. So pretty happy with the system really, considering. I mean, sometimes we would be just parked up for days and running the fridge or wouldn't have much solar or much light so um yeah i'm pretty happy with it but it's back up to 14 volts now it hasn't been 14 volts for a long time oh well we're gonna have a shower and then we're gonna head down to the local surf club where it's BYO food platters and have some beers if you like this episode make sure you give it a thumbs up Next week, we continue to see some sights around the Mackay region before heading back south towards home. Just camped by a river, where are we? We are near Gladstone. Near Gladstone. So we're here, we could hear in the background, we're like, what is that big thing walking over? I was like, oh, it must be a cow coming down to the water or something. So today we are heading back down towards Noosa Way. We will hopefully camp down at Tiwa again tonight on the beach. So we had a little bit of a disaster. If you want to support us as creators, you can join our OLT Patreon community. We will have a link here if you want to check it out. Thanks guys, and we'll see you next time.